Hello everyone, welcome to Up Simplified. So I am back with another notification from Regional Center of Biotechnology. यहाँ पर अगर हम देखें तो admissions to MS PhD program of 2024 का दे रखा है. Advertisement को जब हम क्लिक करते हैं, so you can get to this page. यहाँ पर दे रखा है admission for MS PhD program 2024. So यहाँ पर program के बारे में अगर हम देखें तो दे रखा है research based learning is the hallmark of RCB academic program. MS PhD program is offered to students with graduate degree in any discipline of science, engineering or medicine. So this course is offered for the graduate students. The program in its first year, that is in first and second semester, provides extensive learning opportunities in the broad field of life sciences and biotech through rigorous classroom teaching and hands-on lab experiments. So first year, you will get learning opportunities where you will learn lab experiments. Karenge. And then in the second year, you, the student is mostly required to work in a research lab under the supervision of a research guide in an area of mutual scientific interest and submits a master's dissertation at the end of fourth semester. Okay. <clears throat> then based on the performance review of the student, ki kis tarike ka apka performance raha, kaise type ka apka work raha, he or she may be permitted to continue in the program for the pursuing the PhD thesis research in the same lab. At this stage, the student can also exercise his or her choice to exit the program with a master's degree on satisfactory completion of the course and dissertation requirement. So either you can exit the master's degree or you can go for the PhD research in the same lab. Okay. So the overall course curriculum provides an interdisciplinary perspective of modern biotech with high emphasis on lab training. On completion of the coursework, the student is required to work on his or her master's dissertation followed by PhD thesis. MS PhD program is governed by RCB ordinances and regulations. So now let's see PhD admissions ka kya procedure. Hai. So eligibility criteria is given. Indian students ke liye hai. students with 60 degree aggregate marks in bachelor's degree in any branch of science, engineering or medicine are eligible to apply for admission. Students for, from the SC, ST, OBC and PWD categories shall be given a relaxation of 5 percentage marks. Then students in the final year of their qualifying degree program are also eligible to apply provided that they produce a proof of having a secured and required marks in their undergraduate degree program at the time of admission to MS PhD program. Okay, so you should have at least 60% marks in your bachelor's degree. Then eligible students are required to appear for GAT, GAT B, that is Graduate Aptitude Test Biotech. Shortlisted students based on their performance in the GAD B shall be invited for an interview. So you should have qualification of GAD B and then only you will be called for the interview and then the subsequent selection to MS PhD program will be based on the performance in your interview. So according to your performance in, in your interview, the selection will be done. So interview is meant to access the student for his or her aptitude and interest in career in scientific research and development. Then coming to the next, the, the total seats they rakhi, that is up to 20 students who meet the desired criteria, they will be selected. Now for the foreign students, they have also given the eligibility criteria. Students with 60 percentage marks in bachelor's degree in branch of science, engineering or medicine. Then in the final year of their qualifying degree, they are also eligible. Then eligible students are required to apply online for admission and fellowship to the program. Shortlisted students shall be invited to appear for an online interview through video conferencing for the selection to MS PhD program. Then up to five students who meet the desired criteria, they will be selected. Now, fellowships, if we look at the Indian and foreign students admitted to the program shall receive 
RCB Ramachandran DBT Fellowship of Rs. 16,000 per month for the first two years of the program, after which an Indian student is required to qualify JRF, of which can be offered by CSIR, ICMR, DBT or such other funding agencies. So in the first two years, you will be getting the 16,000 per month and after that you have to qualify your exam like CSIR and then you have to take those fellowships from the funding agencies. Then the performance of the foreign students after completion of the MSc component of the program shall be evaluated by student advisory committee and based on its positive recommendation students shall be awarded the RCB DBT International Doctoral Fellowship equivalent to the fellowship offered to an Indian student by other funding agencies as per the relevant DST guidelines. So currently the amount milega for JRF that is rupees 37,000 per month and for SRF it is 42,000 per month. Now the duration of the program, so the duration is 5 years se, maximum 7 years tak rahega. hostel facilities, on campus share boarding and lodging facilities are available for admitted students on payment of prescribed fees. Then coming to the fees structure, it is tarike ka aapko fees pay karna hoga. Fees are payable at the beginning of each semester. Her semester ke beginning mein aapko ye fees pay karna hoga. So for semester first to third, it is academic administration fees is rupees 5000. Tuition fees is 6000. Lab fee is 6000. Medical fees 3000. Student amenities fees. 1000 hostel fee 1200 and for semester fourth onwards it is 5000 tuition fee is not there lab fee 6000 medical fees 3000 student amenity is 1000 and hostel is also 1200 so the question money uh, rupees 5000 which you have paid it will be refundable is payable at the time of admission. PhD thesis exam fee rupees 10,000 is payable at the time of PhD thesis submission and hostel electricity charges as per the installed meter and cooperative mess charges are to be paid as per actual. Then coming to the application procedure. So you have to click on this link for applying the admi for admission and um, you have to pay rupees 500 for the as an application fees SCST PWD students and EWS and foreign candidates are exempted from the payment of application fees now online payment is there then last date for registration is 30th April for Indian and foreign students so for details of get B you can go to this link and contact details are also given for queries you can go to this contact number or you can also go to this email id and ask your queries so this was all about rcb's ms phd program thank you